Hey, what's up, guys? Today, I am going to start my preparations for my husband's return. Uh, I really wanted to start this video out because preparing for your significant other coming home from a deployment or training or whatever is kind of a process in itself. Um, since there are a lot of factors, my husband hasn't been gone too long. It's been when he gets home, it'll be about a month since he had left. So it's not a very long time. It is, but it isn't. Um, I know there's some wives out there that go, or, or, or some spouses, I should say, that um, their significant other is gone for like a couple weeks or months or years. So every return's a little bit different. And I feel like there are some basic things that we have to do for return. Um, so you get in a routine when you're by yourself. So um, preparing them for that when they get back. Um, I pretty much have kept the same routine since it's only been a month. Um, I haven't changed too much. One of my biggest things that I do that my husband does not do, so usually he's the dishes guy. He does the dishes, but he's really bad about doing it right after we eat. And when he's gone, I keep the dishwasher empty and then load it as I go and then do the dishes and then put them away immediately so I can always keep the counter clean. My husband will let them pile up. I probably should just do it myself, but... <laughs> I kind of keep that as his thing because I hate dishes. They're like the worst thing ever. And old food and other people's food just grosses me out. So that's like the only thing that I can really think of um, that is um, changed in the routine. Um, obviously, I've added some things to my routine, which would be me taking care of the animals. So when my husband gets back, honestly... I just drop that and he takes it back. So, um, not that big of a deal. Um, baby routine has pretty much stayed the same since he has left. So I'm not too concerned about that. However, if you, your significant other has been gone for several months or even a year or years, um, it's definitely going to be a big change. And it's, a lot of that is just communication. Like, this is our routine now and you're going to have to fit yourself back in. Um, however that may be. The next thing that I do to prepare for my husband's return, um, we need to do, um, I've been eating for one. I've been eating healthy choice meals. Occasionally I'll make myself like some smaller meals. Um, so a lot of the things I need to do now is just get things ready for when he gets back. So the first thing we do when he gets back is going to the grocery store, going to Sam's Club. Um, don't want to do that. So today we went to Sam's Club. Um, I got some of the things that he wanted. He just let me know what he needed for his lunches when he got back. Um, he got chips and crackers. Um, I got peanuts and um, small packs of donuts. Um, just so we have some of those things already when he gets back, as well as I got diapers and formula, which are also important. I don't want to have to do with that. Um, and then also animal food and those things. So we don't have to worry about that when he gets back, um, later on this week and I will vlog, um, I'll be getting things for meals and hopefully I can get enough for like two weeks of meals or so. Um, we may have to go get veggies and stuff, but, um, I like to have things ready so we can just easily skip the store for a couple weeks or so uh so i do get like meats this is the great time of year to get meat because they're always on sale i freeze a lot of them uh so i will be doing that later this week so tune in for that i will probably most likely be next weekend or um because i'm busy during the week until like late at night so <sighs> that is one of those things i need to do other things um Obviously, I want to prepare the home, um, just making sure things are cleaned up, which I pretty much um, have a routine for that as well, that I just kind of, I sweep during the week, I do the floors, 
So I may, I already cleaned the sheets a week early. He's like, clean them before I come back. I'm like, I already did. Not like directly before he came back, but I cleaned them. Um, making sure the laundry's caught up. I'm gonna do some picking up and straightening up and just refreshing the house a little bit before he gets home. Uh, since things do get cluttered and whatnot when you're busy and on your own with a four month old, um, things can get a little difficult to keep up on. So I will have find time to do that. And if it's just little be bits and pieces, it's better than nothing. Um, I'm trying to think of what else is on my list too. <laughs> Um, so that is just home stuff, making things are sure things are clean. I may even give the dogs a bath. We'll see what happens with that. I don't know if that's actually going to happen, but we'll see what happens. I try not to bathe them too much because they get dry skin really easily. Um, and then um, I don't think I'll have to do yard work before he comes back. It's been really dry here, so the grass isn't growing super fast right now. Um, I've been doing my own gardening things, so I'm not too worried about those sort of things. We did have a storm blow through the other day. may need to pick up some from that, but that's probably other home things that I need to do. The last thing that I kind of do is just make myself look nice. So do some papering. I need to like trim up my hair a little bit. My bangs have grown out so much. So I'm gonna do that. Um, I thought about dyeing or uh, getting another bleaching in my hair. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna do that or not. We'll see what happens. Um, probably not gonna happen. We'll see. I will look at my hair later. Um, so that will be one of those things. And then I think that's about it. I can't think of much else but those are the main things that we'll do so this video may end up being two parts we'll see I've already talked for seven minutes that's crazy so all right we'll move to step one or something like that and you all will see me doing my things and I hope this video is helpful to those that are pairing for a significant other coming home from deployment or training or basic or AIT or whatever branch of the military your significant other is in. I hope this helps you out. So let's get on with it. Okay, it is several days later since I filmed the intro to this video, but I it is Friday currently. Um I am getting ready or I'm currently making my list of things that I need to do. Um, baby's a little bit whiny. He's getting ready to fall asleep. So, um, so what I did was divide up my days. My plan is to leave out Monday. Um, uh, because I don't want, if I don't get something done, I can do it then. Um, even Tuesday some. Um, so I'm going through and just figuring out what I need. Um, I do need to go to the grocery store. I just reminded myself of that. So as I said, um, house things, uh, stocking up on foods, and uh, self-care. So tonight, I'm thinking for my self-care thing, I'm going to go ahead and do my toenails because they've been driving me nuts. I don't know what color I'm going to do yet. Um, I'm going to go ahead and get the laundry folded because that's been driving me crazy. I need to put Petey's away and put mine away. Also because I'll have more laundry. So if I get that done and then I get more, it'll be easier to get done. I don't have that much, but um, I also need to do the dishes. So I'm doing some simple things this evening since... I'm more relaxing because I work today. Tomorrow I have to go to Walmart. Um, he is about to start food, real food. Um, so I need to get some spoons, a bowl, a bowl or two. Um, I'm gonna see what kinds of baby foods they have there. If there's nothing I really want to try, I'm just gonna order them from Amazon next week. I have to go to work for a few hours. 
um, for training. Um, then my dad has been getting some plants from this golf course that he works at. So I'm going to landscape the side of the house over here. So that's going to be another project. Army, military wives in general, whenever their husband's away, we all know that we go and like redecorate things. So that's going to be my outside thing. My inside thing was the rugs, which I love, by the way. Um, my buddy. You're almost asleep, little guy. I believe in you. So I'm going to plant. There'll be an outside thing. After that, I need to trim up my hair. My bangs are getting super long. I think I may go a little shorter with them this time. So I tried this out. The really curtain bang things. Bugger, you, you're doing good. He might actually be ready for a bottle. You're okay. Um, so I need to trim up my hair. It is pretty rough right now. I mean, I know every word I say, we want to be grumpy. Grumpy baby. Um, so I am going to trim these up a little bit. They are getting long. Um, I may do a facial. What's wrong, Bubby? Oh, she's asleep. Um, and then I'm going to do PD. So something for myself and something in the house. Um, and some shopping things I need to do. Luna, go lay down. I don't know why we're up. Lay down. This house is driving me crazy. Okay, and then Sunday I need to go to the grocery store. Um, I'm going to clean the kitchen in the house. Um, it's my longest day. I don't have to do anything besides go to my parents' house. So I'm going to do those things. Get my life sorted back out. Um, I feel like all of that is a good order. Different days have different things, and I'll feel pretty good. Um, let's see. Buddy, you got a little while longer till you can eat. I think he's probably just need some snuggle time, so I'm gonna take him. We're gonna go pick out some nail polish for me, not him. So I'm gonna go warm and cool on this one. So I've got this bright pink. And this uh, shiny blue color. I don't know exactly how I'm going to do it yet. I'll we'll figure that out as I go. Um, anyways, that's what I'm going to do. Maybe I'll do my big toe one color and the rest of them another color. Let's see. Okay, so I've been really, really bad about vlogging today. Um, I was going to vlog myself gardening. Um, I did the dishes today and I cleaned the kitchen. Um, I organized, I'm starting to organize Drew's Father's Day gift since he is not here for Father's Day. Um, uh, and got that all together. So then I went and deck, uh, decorated, landscaped the side of my house like kind of like blank with some plants my dad brought me from work. Um, so those look so nice and I just didn't get around to vlogging it because I was just looking at them. I am dying. Got a Route 44 Sonic drink. Got the little guy with me in the back and I just went and got Sonic in there because um, I was working hard and it's 740. The little guy's going to be wanting to eat soon. So I'm going to start heading home. I just wanted to check in because I am terrible about vlogging today. So hopefully I get more in. In the office. <laughs> um, I'm cleaning the bedroom things while Katie is taking a nap. I'm cleaning my headboard here because it's filthy. It gets so dirty so fast. It's just crazy. Um, so getting that clean. Dogs in the bed. They're outside. 
Um, it was storming here this morning, so I haven't picked the animals yet. Um, my plans for the day are mostly cleaning the house. <laughs> it looks funny. Uh, mostly cleaning the house. Um, starting with the bedroom because it hasn't been cleaned really well in a while. Um, as you can see, like behind me, this stuff right here. That's my elephant. Um, on the um, dresser, is piled up in a sheet. I distracted myself because I was looking for more things this morning to redo the house. And I didn't need you. So I'm actually going to get her phone cord away. So adding things to my list. It's worn out. Cord? I have not plugged in yet. So go ahead and do that. Just getting things done. Anywho, um, so mostly cleaning the house today. Um, I can't remember. I haven't gotten a look at my list this morning. Uh, cleaning and talking. Um, I haven't gotten a look at my list this morning of things that I need to do. Click my light. <laughs> like the light's going on now. Um, I did get laundry started this morning, so I'm going to fold that here. Um, if he wakes up, I have his little door bouncer. He's only gotten to use it once, so I'm hoping that we can play it back for a little bit once he actually like wakes up. Um, I need to feed the animals. I need to go outside and plant um, a couple of things. Um, my husband likes to have gourds in the fall. Um, even though we probably don't know if he's going to be here this fall or not. Um, I would like to get those planted for him. Um, and I think there's a few other things that I want to do in here. I have some things I definitely need to clean up. Um, baby bed is kind of in the way of some things as well. So I need to probably just take it down and drop one of my chopsticks behind my bed. And I can't get to it unless I do the baby bed. I can't wait till he's in his own crib, but at the same time, I know I'm going to be going crazy when we finally move him over there. We were hoping around six months, um, but I'm definitely going to let him kind of leave the or not. We do let him nap in his crib and things, but, and then I'm worried that when my husband gets employed, he's just going to end up back in here. So I definitely want to make sure that we're all comfortable with it before we actually move him. Um, again, I'm confined for this up for up to a year. So, anyways, I'm going to get back to cleaning. Okay, it is Monday evening. I'm currently putting the rest of Petey's clothes away. I can't remember what I've updated about. My mind has been all over the place and trying to uh, get things together um, at home and um, I put this on the hanger wrong. <laughs> uh, been busy with work today and I had a really, really long day so I'm like, don't remember what I did. But I did clean the kitchen. I got the bedroom mostly cleaned up. I didn't get the dresser cleaned off. Um, I did cut my bangs. I do like them a lot more. Um, this side is a little, I don't know I, if it needs like just a little more angling on it, but I am happy with like the length of them. Um, so, and Petey's room it has not been cleaned yet, but I can do that this weekend, I guess. Um, and none of these things were like detrimental to our well-being of life. It was just some things that I wanted to get done. Of course, we all know how things work out. We can't always do that. So, um, the majority of Petey's clothes that I have to put away right now are... Um, blankets and things that I just decided to do laundry so I'm gonna go ahead and do that I'm never gonna get done if I keep talking so 
So I think I'm gonna close out this video and start a new one. Um, I didn't really vlog things as much as I thought I was going to, but I still hope this video is helpful to some of you out there preparing for your significant other coming home. Um, um, kind of la this morning, last night, I just did some last minute things that I needed to get done, like dishes and laundry. So they're all kind of boring, but um, I hope this video is helpful again. And... I think that's all I've got for today. I hope you all like and subscribe for future content. We have things coming up um, military-wise if you're into that thing. And definitely a lot more videos about the little guy. So, um, I'll talk to you all soon in the next video.